Hello everybody, it's Ezra time again. I welcome back to another reaction video. And today I'm going to be reacting to SFM FNAF The Beginning of Chaos Part 3 by once again Zhang 37 and Zhang 37 just upload this and I think he also upload the full episode of The Beginning of Chaos, you know, the full episodes because there are three parts apparently. You know, 1, 2 and 3 obviously this is the new one. Um so I think in the last episode it kind of end with the the special force team, I guess. All well, this there is only like one person left, right? One survivor left, and then that person got locked in the security room uh, with Shadow Freddy or Nightmare, I guess. So I don't know what happened after that. Um, hopefully, we get to see what happens. And I think this is the last part of the beginning of Chaos because Zhang C37 decided to upload the full episode of the beginning of Chaos. So basically, he merged all three of them in one video. So I actually kind of. I actually kind of want to react to the full episode, but at the same time, I am only here to see the part 3, because part 1 and 2, I already watched it, you know, I already react to it, so I don't think I need to see it again. Um, i just here for part 3, so I decided then, you know what, I'm just going to react to the beginning of Chaos 3, you know, the full episodes, uh, whatever, you know, whatever, I guess. Um, I mean, I'm, I'm really glad that he merged them, so we can watch them in just, in one video only, but, I don't know, we just... I don't think I have to react to part 1 and 2 again because again I, I already did that so you know I'm just here for part 3 so you know what without further uh, ado let's just get into the video shall we The beginnings of chaos part 3 I'm the agent of chaos Are you afraid of me? Come on! What are you waiting for? Shoot me. Oh shit. Yeah, try and shoot him. That's not gonna work anyway. Do it. Oh god. Oh god. God, that was scary. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty messed up. It's not that, obviously. You're already talking about a nightmare animatronics. How unfortunate. Hmm, yeah. Oh god. Nothing can kill me. I am immortal. Hmm. And you are doomed. Oh god, yeah. Goodbye. Oh god. Shit, dude. Freddy, everything will be fine. We'll find a way to escape. You can't be so worried. I don't care. In some way you what find did a you way. say? I don't care anymore. I don't want to run away anymore. You can't say that. We must fight. No. Are you so stupid that you don't get it? Where are you going to escape? Humans have shown that they consider us to be the same monsters as nightmares. Yeah, that's They true, don't though. care about us. Do you really think if we escape, they'll help us? They'll catch us and destroy us, because they see us as a threat. Mm. But our friends... They're dead! Except for Chica. Do you really think they'll come to our rescue after so long? Oh, that's a good point though. Oh god, what are you planning, Nightmare Foxy? Oh boy, what what an episode like once again. Man. So yeah, we still haven't find out what happened to Tojika because she ended up in this place. Um maybe this is where he she find her sword because if the intro was believable I'm sorry, the outro was believable because I thought this is just a cool background of the outro, you know, like uh the second pizzeria, the nineteen eighty seven one. And then 
Zhang'e 37 just make it old and rusty and there is a pipe leaking, there's water everywhere. Um, I thought it was cool, you know, I thought it was a cool background for the outro, but apparently no, it was actually part of the story, we kind of find out. Um, so all the Special Force team just died, apparently, I mean, yeah, you can kill a Nightmare animatronic. There, once again, Nightmare even say, said himself that, you know, he is immortal, like every single animatronic is immortal, basically, or the Nightmare, I guess, the Nightmare animatronic was immortal, and literally you, and literally you can kill them, you know, because I always imagine that the Nightmare animatronic was you know like it was so big and buff and scary and all that kind of stuff and of course their armor i guess quote unquote i don't think it's called ar armor but you know um their endoskeleton i guess or whatever you want to call them it was really tough ob obviously like you can't kill him with, with a fucking you know a freaking bullet obviously because it's not gonna do anything you know it's not gonna do shit to them um to the normal a animatronics maybe it will hurt them i don't know because i, I guessing their endoskeleton was weaker or something like that um uh or their armor i guess i don't think it's called armor anyway because i don't think animatronic is wearing an armor so it's kind of weird to say that but you know what i mean like they the nightmare animatronic was really tough you know um and all the special force team is that i mean what did i expect anyway i'm expecting that the human will teaming up with the animatronics but we didn't actually get that sadly and freddy actually pulled up a good point there in the end that do you think humans will help us? Like, they're, they're gonna scare off us. Like, yeah, it's a good point. If you've seen an, a life-size animatronics came to life and speak to you, you're gonna be freaking out, obviously, you know. Um, so I don't know, again, I don't know what happened to Freddy, Chica, BB, and JJ. Like, we know Toy Chica is gonna do her mission. Like, it's obvious since the first place. But what happened to them? What happened to Freddy, Chica, BB, and JJ? Like, are they gonna escape the place? What is Nightmare Foxy doing there? Because Nightmare Foxy is ears dropping i think ears dropping freddy and chica so what does he plan is he is it gonna tell nightmare and then nightmare's gonna let them go for some i know for some reason maybe just to messing with them like oh let let them go and then we're just gonna hunt them down i don't know i don't know maybe that's the case or maybe the nightmare is gonna challenge them like you know what freddy you bring a good point why don't you find out yourself you know is it is the humans gonna help us you know the you know freddy chica bb and jj or they're gonna kill them you know um, I don't think it's gonna be easy to convince a human to working with an animatronics, you know. Or maybe, maybe at some point they're gonna try to escape, and maybe they're gonna manage to convince the humans. And and uh, because again, I'm assuming Tojika ending up in the future because again, the place, the second pizza rest was really old. Um, so I'm assuming maybe he ending up in the future, like in far future, where the war is actually beginning. That's what I'm, that's what my prediction is. Uh, maybe maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. But that, that's what I'm thinking, like maybe he, she, because again, she had the time machine, so maybe she ending up in the, in the far future where the war is actually starting, you know. And maybe there is some survivors in this building, and then, because we see a human in this hallway, I think, in the, I can't forget the episode's name, but, I, if I'm not mistaken, there is a human in this hallway, right here, and then Tojika was lying right there in the, in this part, I think, um, and maybe maybe Freddy, Chica, BB, and JJ managed managed to convince the human to work together with them. Uh, maybe maybe that's where they're gonna find this human's gonna find Tochika and like, oh, is this the animatronics that you know? Is this animatronic is bad or good? I don't know. Maybe maybe he's gonna bring them to you know Freddy. If Freddy and the rest of these gangs is managed to convince the humans, and maybe because I always assuming that the nightmare animatronics is you know they actually stay in i don't know the timeline i don't know if they, they actually took place in the past or in the future i don't know about the timeline in the new pizzeria it's kind of vague in a way but i'm assuming it's in a f in you know because three years later so i'm assuming it's going to be 2023 that's when the nightmare animatronic was staying with you know freddy and his friends and then tojika is gonna probably ending up in the future i don't know when Again, I'm assuming, but then again, maybe it's not I maybe it's not far in the future because this place opened in 1987 and the third place, um, season three took place 30 years later, right? So basically in 2023, basically, if we believe the original timeline, because if I believe the first Freddy Fazbear pizza, you know, um, it's actually in 1993 where the classic pizza, you know, you know, from the first game, um, if I remember, Zenith 37 said it was in 1993 and then... And then in the end of season three, we kind of wasn't in the end of season three, but towards the middle of season three, we kind of like 
shifting from the pizzeria and then to the fast bear fright you know and i think if we if we actually believe the timeline that the game timeline was 30 years after <laughs> oh sorry guys um 30 years after the first pizzeria was closed or the third pizzeria was closed i guess um so it took place in 2023 and then where freddy where the nightmare animatronic is now staying you know in the pizzeria was maybe in 2023 also i don't know and it's kind of makes sense if this place was old anyway because again this place is open in 1987 and then and then right now we're in 2023 you know in this timeline i, I don't know how true it is I'm, I'm just assuming uh maybe i'm wrong i'm sorry about that <laughs> if i'm wrong but yeah so far it's getting really exciting guys i'm really i'm just you know i'm just making theories here and there and i'm probably wrong in the future uh I, i'm pretty sure i'm gonna roll my ass like like oh like it's so obvious or something like that or maybe my theory was wrong and i'm sorry theory i don't know uh but so far yeah i'm i'm really really exciting you know um maybe we're gonna find out what happened to tochika because i'm really curious what happened to her because um there is a human right in the hallway and he found tochika but what did the humans gonna do is it is the human gonna kill tochika i mean obviously he didn't because we kind of find out that hey he's still alive i'm sorry she's still alive and she's still doing his mission but what i'm really curious is what happened to freddy chica bb and jj because there is no clear indication what happened to them hopefully they don't die but then again we don't know we don't we we really don't know you know and we didn't actually find out what the ending of the Tojika mission i mean it's kind of obvious anyway i don't know it's gonna be a good ending or a bad ending we have to see i mean fingers crossed it's a good ending but then again i don't know we we don't know um but yeah guys i really enjoyed this episode and if you guys want to watch the original video um i will put a link in the description below as always um as you guys like zhang 37 channel um subscribe to him showing show him some support because this guy's been making this amazing storyline and since season two actually since the final plans he zhang 37 is planning this since the final plan and this is like the end game moment of the of his story you know season four is the final season i think and i'm pretty sure it's still a long way to go before you know before the ending because there is a lot of stuff going on like what happened to freddy and his friend the tochika mission and then the war there is so much stuff is still going on in the future so i, I don't i don't think it, this series is gonna end anytime soon which is make me really exciting because more episodes <laughs> you know uh but yeah mr guys again once again uh check Gen 37 channel subscribe to him um this man is still is still dedicated to making this episode even though the fnaf community is it's less now i mean it's still going but it's less you know it's not that popular anymore like fnaf was like back then we were, it was very popular but right now it's not that popular anymore you know i think some people get sick of fnaf <laughs> and again i can't blame them um because it's just keep going and going and going and going you know but i'm really glad that zangu 37 is still making this video you know it, like he's still dedicated on creating his story and dedicated to finish his storyline i i really appreciate that you know uh, so once again check check his channel you know um show him some support subscribe to his channel and if you guys enjoy my reaction video please leave a like comment maybe subscribe to this channel or uh, maybe share this video to your friends or family and if you guys subscribe to my channel ma make sure you guys don't forget to ring the notification bell uh so you guys get you know notified when i upload the video so uh, and, and yeah so far i really enjoyed this episode guys i really can't wait to see what happens next and yeah that's it for today's video and i will see you guys in the next one then Bye.